Are y'all doing out there? This easy work boxing, baby. About to hit you everywhere, but under your feet with this one. Please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Got some good news, man. Well, some funny news going on. Some boxing news. Some boxing beef going on. Mr. Terrence Crawford had to step to uh, Riley Romero. You know, Riley always running around calling people a bunch of bitches. And, <laughs> you know, talking about he'll knock this person out. He'll whoop this person's ass. All right, now, uh... I keep telling y'all Terrence Crawford is from the streets, man. This is a real hood, dude. Y'all don't understand that. Out of all the boogie, man, you know, I got Demetrius Andrade, Gary Russell, you know, uh, even Shakur Stevenson. I got uh, Devin Haney. The head boogie man is Terrence Crawford. Now, this is what that happened. Now, I don't really know the situation or what went on about them saying that Riley lying. I don't know if they saying Riley got on Twitter and tried to say other words or what actually happened between him and Terrence Crawford. But Barbershop Conversation, shout out to Barbershop Conversation, posted a video of what happened between them in this situation. Now, apparently, Riley, after the uh, Garcia, Garcia fight uh, and Spence fight, he scammed somebody out some money at the fight. Now, he didn't know who he scammed. All he know, he hit a lick and he was finna try to get away with the shit. <laughs> but unfortunately for Riley, he done found out that that was Terrence Crawford, Ken Folks. And, you know, I'm from down, how, down south, so that's family member, cousin. You know how it go. So, uh, Terrence, see him straight up tell him, like, I want to beat your ass. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, $20 is the principal. $20 ain't shit, but it's the principal. You understand? Like, you first of all, Riley, you make too much motherfucking money to be something that's swindling people out of money. So anyway, Floyd, I mean, um, um, Terrence telling Riley he want if this video go off, I'm sending it up. If Rod, Floyd, I mean, Terrence tell Riley, I want to beat your ass. You know what I'm saying? Where you stay at? Where you spy at? All right, we got to fight. We got to come to the gym. We got to spar. He was like, man, I'm with Floyd, Floyd. So Terrence called up his boss, not his boss, Riley's boss. <laughs> he called up his boss, said, hey, you know, but right then the video cut off. You know what I'm saying? So. A little bit about it, you know, what I think happened. Of course, you know, Terrence finished the conversation like, hey, I want to beat his ass. We need to handle this shit about what he done did to my family member. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure Floyd was like, hey, I'm Floyd probably was with it. Because, you know, at the same time, that is disrespectful. But being as though Floyd got a contract with the man and he got uh, this bad business to really let Terrence Crawford go beat up on your fighter. I'm sure Floyd was like, man, nah, don't do that, man. Tell Floyd probably was like, hey, man, I tell you what, tell your folks, man, I'll give them two hundred. I'll send them two thousand dollars about the twenty. Don't fuck with Riley. Riley know better than that. I apologize for Riley. I, that's what I'm saying. I'm not saying that, but basically, Riley talking about everybody else a bunch of bitches. Riley turned into a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> like uh, the song Juvenile says, you know how they be talking that shit till they click, and when you catch them by themselves, they transform to a bitch. <laughs> Riley was something that man, they don't like me. He kept saying something about somebody else don't like him and something like that. But Taryn was like, I want to beat your ass, bro. Like Riley, but Riley. I like Riley. Riley cool, you know what I'm saying? But Riley, why you out there scamming people? And you you a boxer, you making money, man. You know, I ain't in your pockets. I don't know how much you got to make. I mean, like they say, any lick is a good lick. You know, you whatever you left with is better than what you had. I don't give a fuck you left with $10. So, you know, but at the same time, you, bro, why is you out there doing that? And see, that's something people got to learn about in life. You be careful about who you fucking with because you don't know who they can to and who they know and what they're a part of. So that's a, something everybody else need to think about too as well because see, why, how he know there wasn't no mob nigga family member or some nigga over Texas syndicate or some shit like that or you know what I'm saying? Fuck around, Riley has been somewhere hanging from a ceiling. <laughs> Didn't nobody know <laughs> Well, you know, Terrence said he going to beat that ass. He want to beat that ass. Hopefully, he don't get a chance to beat that ass. Hopefully, Floyd take care of that. Hopefully, uh, the situation get handled to where Terrence don't have to do nothing to Riley or hurt Riley. You know, but um, I just had to get on here and report that Riley said quit fucking with people. Quit being scandalous and stay out of that shit, man. Just focus on boxing. You make too much money. I'm not in your pocket. I don't know how much you make. But I'm sure it's more than $20, man. You too, you you doing too well to be out there doing some whole shit like that. You almost got your ass. <laughs> stay out the way, Riley. Worry about training. Get Floyd to work on them skills so you won't be getting no more gift decisions. Go do some positive. You're doing some positive. You're making good money, my brother. Stay out the way, my nigga. Terrence, don't beat up. Don't beat this man up. Let, let, 
Don't worry about it. Let it go. I know that's your family. You want to make an example out of his ass. Don't beat him up, Tan. They don't need no problems. This is a work boxer, man. Thank y'all for y'all time. Please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Most definitely hit that like button. Please comment. If you like to donate, it's all connected to the channel, man. I just thank y'all, man. Like I said once again, January 24th, we going back live. I can't go live. I've been striked. Something I didn't even do. You know, I'm innocent as hell, but I didn't do it. But thank y'all, man. I love y'all for y'all support. Keep watching. Hit that notification bell. I'm out.